Water is an essential part of life. Accessibility to clean water is a privilege that 783 million people in the world do not have. Research done by the UN has shown around 6 to 8 million people die annually from consequences of disasters and water-related diseases. While Sri Lanka is home to an abundance of water sources, there are many areas that do not have access to clean water and the Anuradhapura district is no exception. It is a known fact that the consumption of unclean water causes many sicknesses and has a direct effect on people's lives. Education is disrupted, economic development is challenged and overall causes many problems for families, communities and to the country. Adding to the issues surrounding the lack of clean water is the fact that the Anuradhapura district has a very high number of people that have fallen ill to kidney diseases. According to a research done by the World Health Organization, more than 15% of the population aged 15 to 70 years in the North Central and the Uwa province carry chronic kidney diseases. While the phenomenon is known as chronic kidney disease of unknown origin, it is a widely accepted fact that pollutants in the water consumed by communities causes this grave issue. It is into this setting that Adra Sri Lanka entered the Anuradhapura district with the Gift Water Project. Funded by Adra UK, the project introduced a novel concept of water purification and distribution for the first time in Sri Lanka. Through the Gift Water Project, Adra Sri Lanka established seven community water dispensers in communities that had a dire need for clean water and had many people affected by the chronic kidney disease. The community water dispensers are special units that purify water using the reverse osmosis technology. Since the water sources for these community water dispensers are deep bore wells, the chances of the water being polluted is almost zero. The project has taken extensive measures to ensure that the water source and the water purification system is safe from pollutants at all times. Water tested from the water source and the water dispenser have proven to be fit for human consumption and shows no pollutants at all. Each of these community water dispensers has the capacity to produce 800 gallons of purified water each day and is adequate to meet the needs of the communities that they are installed in. The novelty of the community water dispenser is mainly in the way the community will access the purified water. Community members are issued an electronic card which can be recharged by the address staff for any amount required. The card can then be inserted into the machine and the desired quantity of water can be acquired. The individual will be charged only for the amount of water acquired from the dispenser. The purified water is sold at a very nominal rate, far less than the other providers in the district. The money raised by the sales is used to ensure the proper maintenance of these community water dispensers and will also be used for various hygiene and sanitation related activities in the communities themselves. Thus, the community water dispenser in a sense becomes a mechanism of change in the communities. Since the establishment of these community water dispensers, the communities have highlighted their happiness in access to clean water so close to their homes and appreciates the contributions made by the donors towards this noble task. Adra Sri Lanka has been developing the Gift Water Project since 2013. We see the opening of the first community water dispenser today here at Kuttikolama in Anuradhapura. We have planned to establish seven of these machines. We never develop projects by ourselves. We always involve the community. Uh, so therefore, the project itself was designed based on the needs of the community. But something else that you need to know about this project is that it's not only about pro providing water, but the project is going beyond that to promote health and hygiene in communities. So this will be a starting point through which uh, the whole community will benefit to have a more greater awareness about health and hygiene. And we're confident that this unit that we established will sustain itself and that it will also help the community in various ways. This project is funded by ADRA UK and we are very sure that it will be a change agent in this community. 
For more information, visit our website or write to us. Yet another initiative of Adra Sri Lanka to change the world one life at a time.